course here, taking a look at doing some Elden Shamblin style rhythm on the tune Roly Poly. Since I just did a video kind of doing some lead ideas, I thought I'd show you the outline of the chords and a few little basic ideas that you can use to work through this tune. So the, the tune's based out of the key of G. We're gonna be primarily using only the things we've covered in the last kind of vi uh, few videos on Faded Love, talking about those kind of basic chord shapes. And the basic progression is two bars of G, a bar of C, and then a bar of G. From there, it's two bars of G, a bar of A, a bar of D. Then we do the progression again, so two bars of G, one of C, one of G, and then it's a bar of G, a bar of D, two bars of G. That's the A section. So slowly that'd be G, C, G, G, to the A, D, G, to the C, G, G, D, G, to the C chord for the B section, back to the G, to the A chord, then to the D chord, back to the G, and it's doing the second half of the A section, Okay, so that's the basic idea. So we're just gonna take this down, kind of playing the G, and work up to a G7 with the F in the bass, and then I'm gonna come up to the C here, with the G in the bass, then the C with the E in the bass, and then walk back up to the G. So I have... Just like that. I could even just do like one part of the C chord and then walk up. So I could go like G. And walk back up that way. From there, I'm going to start on my third here, of my G triad. So I have the B in the bass. Then I'm going to do the, the major seven in the bass. Then the sixth in the bass. Then the fifth in the bass. That's a really nice common move he does. It's pretty. If you just take the bass notes, third, major, seventh, 